Hi, this is Steve here. So today I'm going to show you how we can manually just um, install the mods for Zero Sievert and uh, hope this is uh, a good uh, reference. So basically what I have here is uh, I've installed it into this directory path for my Zero Sievert which is on the C drive, Games Zero Sievert. So locate where your installation is and with and in that folder usually you see this list of files for your game. Okay, so you will see that um, there will be a data win file here and then there is a folder called the uh, Zero Sievert Vanilla. Okay, so on my left here you can see that I've downloaded some of the mods. Now for this uh, tutorial, or if you want to call it, um, I've downloaded the necessary files from Nexus mod and uh, I'm going to try and install the uh, Escape from Zarkov uh, mod for the Zero Sievert. So first of all, we have the, uh, the custom sprite, the external audio, the GM loader, the JSON override uh, and as well as the uh, you need to download the uh, EFC um, uh, mods as well so um, so with the magic of uh, internet so basically poof I downloaded the the base uh, EFC 1.11 for this case the mod for the installation so right now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna extract this and put whatever the content which is in the zip file into the zero sievert main folder here so I'll do the same for here okay you, you can't actually see anything because I'm on another unshared uh, windows so basically I'm just uncompressing all that as you can see it's creating a mod uh, folder here so there are some contents being uh, extracted okay so I'll go on and unzip the rest as well okay and now I'm gonna unzip the GM loader so you can see GM loader which is in that directory. Now I'm going to uh, unzip as well the EFZ uh, mod. So just drag and drop the mods and you will see right now that's populated with a list of uh, folders. Okay. Um, and then once all this is done, uh, we can just go ahead and load the uh, GM loader. Okay, so I'll just right click and then in fact I'll just double click it. Okay, and I'll share the other screen. So you will see that the uh, GM loader executable files will be running and the following things will be uh, being shown on the console. Okay, it might be different from case to case. Um, so, right after that's done, right after that's done, you can see the game data has been recompiled and it will launch the game. Okay, so let's go back quickly to the, uh, the directory for the game. You can see that it's created a backup, which is the backup win here. Okay, you can see that. Right, there's an additional file being created called backup.win and it's running on the modded uh, EFZ 1.11. So how do we actually verify that uh, that's uh, that the mod is running for the EFZ 1.11? So you can see here, once the game is launched, you will see under the title 
right down below here the EFC one dot whatever the version that's being installed okay and uh, yeah so from then on you can just go right ahead and start the game uh, create a new game okay hope this helps see you bye